Welcome, Dr. Marcus Dafter. Thank you, Tricia. Welcome. Thank you, Madison and Veronica, for sharing. All right, now, I am here because I believe it is important to question the drive behind companies' commitment to CSR. I mean, often businesses use CSR for ulterior motives for their own self-interest. Often businesses use it to distract the public from the ethical questions posed by their core operations. I mean, personally, I believe that there is no place for social responsibility as a business function. Corporations are responsible for generating a product in order to gain profits to satisfy their shareholders. They're not responsible for social actions. Unfortunately, most of the CSR that is done is done for public relations benefits, not because the company cares for the environment or the community. Do you have a lot? Always, Marcus. Thank you. Where was I? Right. For the environment or for their community. Companies use CSR for their own self-interest, to raise their reputation with the public or with the government. But, I mean, you know, for example, McDonald's Corporation. And let me tell you, they make a mean McMuffin in the morning. They were recently under scrutiny for its CSR because, well, the company talked a lot about CSR and put it on and put on a good CSR dog and pony show. The same company was found out to be mistreating their workers. They had misleading advertising. And they were found to be mistreating animals. Animals! Can you believe it? If we want companies to behave in a more responsible manner, we need stronger government and international regulations, not more voluntary measures by the company. Okay, well, that was quite the different view than we've heard from our other guests. Um, thank you to all of our guests. No, thank you. Thank to you. To Marcus, to Veronica. Good night. And to, what was that spazzy girl's name? I don't remember. <laughs> no. Thanks for helping us see all the different views there are on CSR. That's all for tonight. Please, tune in tomorrow as we interview a scientist who has discovered an actual asteroid in the North Hills area. Thank you and good evening. Do -do -do -do. <laughs> Welcome to Rectenwald Brothers Construction News. <laughs> Welcome to Rectenwald Brothers Construction Incorporated News. Harry does that. Stop it. Great.